Dentist, when does a flap necrose? Typically, it's been over-traumatized during your initial flap elevation or during the surgical procedure or during healing, which means suturing technique. During the initial elevation, you got to be delicate with this tissue. Remember, this is the tissue you're going to utilize to close. Make sharp, nice, clean incision design. Retrace your incision to make sure you establish a full thickness flap. Two, when you do your elevation, use a sharp, clean molt. Always elevate across the flap. Don't elevate one area deep and start moving across. Instead, go all the way down across the flap length. Three, during the surgical procedure, protect your flap. A larger flap gives you better access, you reduce the trauma. Four, make sure it's a tension-free closure. If your tissue starts staying blanched, if it's overly compressed, you're gonna get necrosis. If you're interested to learn more, click on the link below, put a little video together that goes over all these aspects of periodontal surgical procedure.